welcome back to Trusted Nose with the man that likes to smell good. I hope you're well, in good health, and of course, smelling great, smelling tan tan, just smelling. So recently, a cheapie caught my eye, which goes by the name of Our Rehab Choco Musk. And this is a good thing because, you know, buying fragrances isn't cheap. And, you know, I'm a little broke boy at heart. But God willing, in the future, I'll have money. Someone say amen. All right, then. So, <laughs> Choco Musk caught my eye. Um, I bought the fragrance oil and I bought the actual fragrance sprayer. So, I'm going to do a, a direct comparison. But overall, for this fragrance, there isn't too much you can really say about it. So, this is going to be a quick review. But anyway, I'm doing too much talking and I'm ready. I hope you're ready. So we got the Our Rehab Choco Mask quick review. Let's go. So let me start off with the best thing about Our Rehab's Choco Mask, or Choco Mask, sorry. It's the price point, yeah? The price point is healthy, <laughs> yeah? Healthy, healthy. So the fragrance oil literally cost me like, I think it was like two pounds, like nine pence. And then the actual fragrance sprayer was like nine pounds, maybe nine pounds fifty. But altogether, I'm getting both of these for what, less than thirteen pounds. So yeah, that's that's good enough to me. Uh, so let me go on to the actual smell. Like, what am I actually smelling? What does it actually smell like? And yeah, I don't know what everyone else was smelling when they were saying it smells like I don't know, like a type of cereal. They were trying to do like a technical breakdown. Listen, yeah. This is literally cocoa butter, yeah. <laughs> Palmer's cocoa butter, just a slightly sweeter version, slightly more vanilla version of Palmer's cocoa butter. So when everyone's saying that, oh, it smells like melted chocolate and not nah, nah, yeah, <laughs> it doesn't. It just smells like a win cocoa butter, which is good because cocoa butter is popular. Um, it's a familiar smell. Uh, Quite a lot of people like it as well. So if you like cocoa butter, I suggest that maybe you should just try it blind buying this because it's only like two pounds. Um, in terms of compliments now, and like, as I just said, like quite a lot of people like cocoa butter. Unfortunately, I can't really like test it out properly because you know, like, we're in lockdown. I don't know when this situation is gonna end, but hopefully sometime in March they'll, they'll allow us out to play. So um, I literally asked my dad, because um, he's into fragrances as well. I asked my sister because she's uh, she's quite like hard to please when it comes to fragrances, and I asked my mum as well, and they all seem to like it. So uh, yeah, <laughs> they like it because they like the smell of cocoa butter. So uh, in terms of performance now, so with the sprayer, the performance is wonky. Yeah, the performance is wonky. I had to repeat it twice. So when you first spray the sprayer, you're literally just gonna get, what, like 10 minutes of pure ethanol. Yeah, pure alcohol. I remember when I first sprayed it, I thought like there was something wrong with the bottle. So I had to do like research online and people were saying the same thing, like they were just smelling alcohol for 10 minutes. So you're gonna get alcohol for 10 minutes and then you're gonna get the cocoa butter smell. And it literally like performs for like 30 minutes and after that it becomes a skin scent but it doesn't really last long. So I suggest you overspray with this. Like, not that I suggest like you need to overspray with this. So if you can get past the, like, the proper alcoholic opening, then fair enough. You can, I don't know, rock this. With the fragrance oil, uh, so projection, this one didn't project as much as the sprayer, but it was, it was all right. It wasn't like average level, but it was just below average, but I didn't really have much expectations for it because it was only like two pound. But longevity wise, it actually lost quite a decent amount. I wouldn't say a good amount, but a decent amount, obviously depending on how much you apply onto your skin. So it lasted on my skin for about like five, six hours, which is okay. Cause like I said, I'm only paying two pounds. So I don't really have like a big expectation for it. But overall, would I, so what would I suggest you get in the, the, uh, the fragrance oil or the sprayer? Listen, yeah, if I could dash this right now without it smashing on the floor, I'll do it, yeah. 
get the fragrance oil because the sprayer literally is is cheeks like i can't i can't lie to you it's, it's ass yeah <laughs> it's ass get the fragrance oil it's like a good like base layer um it's a nice scent as well it's quite unisex it's just yeah it's it's good value for money at the end of the day it's good value for money so as always if you like this video please remember to like comment and subscribe i'll be much appreciated also follow me on instagram trusted underscore nose and yeah thank you for watching